saw earlier about arts education. It was a project by her daughter Charlotte Harrison um, at, at Perry Harrison last year when she was in the eighth grade. She did that and won an award at her school. So we're thrilled to have that lovely piece to present to you all. Joy. We would be happy to have your money to review some of that for scholarships this year. We also want to start um, awarding teacher grants to help see you know, back in the year. Can I take a minute? Most of our, I think all of our um, executive board from the foundation is here tonight. Can they stand up, please? I'd love for you to meet them at the reception this, after, this evening after the program. Stop by and say hello. If you're looking for a way to get involved, I'd be happy to give you some information. Um, if you'd like to have an ad or become a sponsor in our programs, you can also sign up for that out in the lot. We have just a few minutes before we have a reception planned in the cafeteria. Does anybody have questions for any of our guests tonight? Um, stand up. Yes. Hi. Um, I was just wondering if we could get some more details on the timing of phase two of the of the building. Okay. I have children. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes. Uh, phase two will be completed phase one with the bleachers and the traffic circle and the enlargement of the cafeteria. Phase two is scheduled to start this school year, during the year. And uh, as soon as we can get the, uh, the bids led and, and get that work done, it will actually begin this school year with hopes, plans of having phase two completed by the time school opens next school year. That's, that's the plan. So we will be enlarging the, in the instrumental vocal arts department here, this part of the building, this side out, okay. uh, creating a larger space, a larger area there, as well as building a um, uh, lobby area onto the gym out here. So this part of the building will look totally different next year when school opens. And we ask your patience and your consideration in having to do construction while school is in. I know that's <laughs> no fun. I've had to do that. I opened a school once that was 75% brand new school. It was only about next year only about 75 percent. Mr. Blyce was my uh, band instrumental music teacher there. We only had about 75, 80 percent of the school finished when we had to open it. So construction was going on while the children were in school. And even though it's nice to have them there, they're not real good at construction. Work, so we, the children, <laughs> so we uh, we want to uh, you know, take all precautions and ask everyone's patience, understanding the tolerance as we renovate while we have school. This, this room is going to become a multi-purpose room. So it's, it's, uh, it's going to wear a lot of hats. If you don't have any other questions at the moment, I invite you all to see our new cafeteria. And um, maybe we'll have an opportunity to say hello to our guests and faculty and have a few minutes and speak to them. Thank you so much for coming. We really appreciate it.